Our best selling product is the Celebration Scroll. It measures 11 inches wide by 17 inches long and it comes with a gold foil seal that you'll sign right in front of your customers to certify that all the information is authentic. It's very easy to print a celebration scroll. The first step is to type your customer's name here in the top box. In this case, we'll print out Mr. Sullivan's scroll. In this bottom section where we have the list of names, you'll notice that there are different instances for the name Sullivan. Our Mr. Sullivan is from Ireland, so we'll select this row right here that says Sullivan, written in English, with the country of origin, Ireland. You'll click on that twice. You'll see that that name appears over here in the selected names box. We're going to make a product for Mr. Sullivan, so go up to your products button and click on that once. Now we're on our product page. You'll see three columns, and in the first column, category, you want to click on family name history. In the center column or product column, you'll click on celebration. And in the third column, size, there's only one option, so there's not much to do there. I wanted to draw your attention to this part of the screen down here. This drop-down box is the color of the background that's going to be printed on the product. There's different options there, from none, where there'll be no color, to parchment, yellow, and 1400. I think 1400 is the best color, so I'd leave that on 1400 and it will stay there for all the, all the products that you print. This next button, ribbon, is three color or four color, and it just doesn't matter which one is there, so just leave that one alone. So your settings are all set, family name history, celebration, ledger, and you've got your background color set to 1400 and you want to print that. So click on print and up to this point you haven't spent any money on ticks. If you're ready to go ahead and want to print this then click on yes. Now you'll see the same preview of the history that you showed your customer as a free preview. You'll want to print this so click on the print button and here's the name that will appear on the top banner. In this case, it's Sullivan. Be very careful to make sure that your customer agrees with how their last name is spelled. I know this sounds like a trivial point, but if your customer doesn't have their name at the top of the scroll, they're not going to want to buy it. So Mr. Sullivan likes how you've spelled his name. You're going to click on OK. And on the bottom banner is the country of origin, which is Ireland. Again, we're going to click OK. Now we have the directions for the printer, what size paper, the orientation of the paper, and you always on every product want to click on properties to make sure that you're printing the proper thing. Under this printing presets column, you can see the various different products we have. In this case, it's the celebration scroll. If that's highlighted by clicking on it, you're good to go and you'll print out a celebration scroll. Click OK and then OK again and your printer will start to print the celebration scroll.